Good morning, Bloom community. I am Cadet Bryce Crosby. This is Lieutenant Junior Grade Nigel Mosley and Cadet Kevin Bowles, and we are members of the Bloom's Navy JROTC. I am coming to you from the Studio 313 with a special homecoming edition of Bloom Scene highlight the history of the Bloom mascot, the Trojan Head. The Trojan Head is the school's mascot because the Trojan Head shows determination, energy, and strength. The Bloom High School Class of 1962 dedicated the Bronx <coughs> Trojan Head to Bloom High School and is inlaid in the floor at the top of the stairs. Outside of the NJROTC classrooms, the NJROTC unit took on the responsibility of maintaining the Trojan Head because shining the bright work is a part of Navy tradition. When maintaining metal or brass artifacts, shining and polishing them shows a sign of pride and respect. The name Blazing Trojans came about when a friend of Mr. Cook's joked about merging Bloom Trail and Bloom Township. Since Bloom's mascot is the Trojan and Bloom Trail's mascot are the Trailblazers. He asked what are they going to call us now, Blazing Trojans? Although it was meant as a joke, everyone thought it was a great idea. The his historical significance and sentiment of the Trojan Head is that it is never to be walked upon. It is to be respected and admired by all because it symbolizes the pride and tradition of Bloom High School. A special thank you to all the Bloom alumni who helped, who were interviewed by Bloom's Naval Science for NJRTC cadets from the Bloom High School class of 2017. Much of the information from the research project was provided by Dr. Horak, Ms. Amadio, Mr. Cook, Mr. Maddox, Mr. Gaz, and Mr. Demon. The Trojan Head is a symbol of our school. Please respect it by not walking on it. Thank you. Thank you, Blooms NJROTC, for that special report. It's Happy Hispanic Heritage Month, Bloom Trojans. The terms Hispanic and Latino tend to be used interchangeably in the United States for people with origins in Spanish speaking or Portuguese speaking countries like Mexico, Costa Rica, and Brazil. Contrary to many beliefs, Hispanic is not a race but an ethnicity. Welcome to the Thursday Show. Coming up on today's edition of Blue Sea Homecoming Court, I am your host, Esther Harris. On activities, we have Austin Richie, and on sports, we have Isaiah Gow. It is Tuesday, October 4th, 2016. You are watching Blue Sea. Now for our top story, it is Spirit Week, Bloom Children. Today is Twin Day, Wednesday is Way Back Wednesday, Thursday is Favorite Movie Star Slash Character in a Movie Day, and of course, Friday is Spirit Day. The dance is this Saturday, and guests will vote on the year's king and queen. We will be getting to know the members of this year's homecoming court all week. Our first couple is Gabriella and Jolene, escorted by Aubrey Fox. Gabriella is a member of choir. She plans on attending college to study music and graphic design. Her greatest memory in high school is making homecoming court. Gabby's favorite song is Fade by Kanye West. Aubrey is a member of senior class, drama club, and choir. She plans on teaching a four-year college and major in film production. His greatest high school memory is doing a spring musical. His sophomore year, Aubrey's favorite song is No Problem by Chance the Rapper. Giselle Esquivel is being escorted by Princeton Nathan. Giselle is a member of Bloom High School soccer team. She plans on attending college and majoring in nursing. She also would like to attend cosmetology school. Giselle loves hanging out with her friends and her greatest high school memory is her sophomore year soccer season. Princeton is a member of the football team. He plans to play college football and major in sports medicine. Princeton's greatest high school memory is his first touchdown as a Bloom Township Trojan. His favorite song is Lil Uzi Vert's 7 Million featuring Future. We will meet other members of court tomorrow. All fourth year students begin your FAFSA. The website to get free money for college is www.fafsaed.gov. Apply for your FAFSA ID number, formerly known as the PIN ASAP at FAFSA.gov. As well, if you have any questions to your counselor, the Bloom Family and Consumer Science Department is holding his annual chili cook-off in the cafeteria on Saturday, October 29th from noon to 3. Faculty, staff, students, parents, family, and friends can all answer email Chef Mekin at bmekin at sdl206.org. Bring your own check 
crock pot or warming pan is turn on. Prepare your chili at home before the cook off and make sure your chili is hot. There will be trophies for the first, second, and third place winners. Winners will be chosen by the votes of people who sample the chili. Admission is $5, which gets you a cup and a spoon to sample of all the delicious chili. Don't forget that after school tutor is held Monday through Thursday until 445. Be sure to get to your location within the first five minutes or you will need a pass. And to renews, if you did not pass the Constitution test, please see Mr. Krasinski to study and take the Constitution test. The Constitution pre Preparation Exam will begin October 3rd and tutoring right after school in room 218 with Mr. Krasinski. That's it for us. Let's go to Austin with your activities. Thanks, Essence. The Fall Band and Choir Concert is tonight, October 4th, here at Bloom. The cost is $5 for adults and $3 for students. The concert starts at 7 p.m. Rio Club Practice for Hispanic Heritage Month Assembly will start today, October 4th. Attention Class of 2018. The junior class is selling class of 2018 shirts for the low, low, low price of $5. See Mrs. Stockwell if you are interested in purchasing a shirt. Senior class will be sponsoring a locker decorating contest homecoming week. It costs $1 to participate and all students are invited. There will be a winner for each class with the grand prize winner getting a free ticket to homecoming. For participation guidelines and to enter the contest, please see Mrs. Miller in the counseling office by the end of the day today. Ladies in progress would like to congratulate Adriana McLean on her nomination for homecoming court. Good luck, ladies in progress. Also wants to offer congratulations to Diamond Boston and Miss Alex. They are the winners of the raffle for the homecoming dance tickets. Thanks to all that support the ladies in progress. The Scholastic Bowl team will hold the practice this Wednesday after school in Mr. Cook's room. We are still in need of freshmen and sophomores for our JV team. This is our last practice before our home meet on Wednesday, October 12th. If you can't make it, see Mr. Cook in room 311 or Miss Jacko in the library. That is it for activities. Now let's go to Isaiah with sports. Thanks, Austin. The varsity football team defeated Red South this past Friday. We won easily 60 to 6. Let's take a look. This game affects us because we're one, we're two games away from playoffs. And as, as a team, we work hard as a team, and that gives us to greater accomplishments that we just hope to go down to playoffs. And then farther at that, if it takes us. Back in the field on Monday we go. The team is now 4 and 2. The team faces Kankakee Saturday at noon in our homecoming game. The varsity soccer team destroyed Kanye Key last Thursday, 9-1. Alex Segoviano and Tony Aldepe each had three goals, two assists. Alex Barnell, Giovanni Ruiz, and Juan Ruiz each had one goal. Adekunle Olola, Alexis Alzalde, and Roberto Correa each had one assist. Keeper Thomas Thorne and Giovanni Ruiz shared time and goal for the wins. Bloom Conference record is down 5 0. The overall record is 14 wins, 3 losses, and 1 tie. The team is away against Rich Central, away at Kankakee on Wednesday, home on Thursday against Rich East for senior night, and away this Saturday against TM North. The boys and girls' car country team are away at Rich Central this weekend on Saturday, October 8th. The varsity foot volleyball team is away today against Kankakee and away tomorrow against Rich Central. That's it for sports. Let's take it back to Essence. That's Bloom Scene. Check us out online. Teachers, email your announcements to Mr. Cook. We will see you here again. He plans to play collegiate. Oh, my God.